versus on the seafloor, you know, half a dozen in just this one shot that are bubbling at the same time. And like both Carolyn and Adam have just said, they were down a really more. appreciative of our ROV team and our video team who are working together right now to work on lighting as well as vehicle position and camera position to capture this um, video in the best way for us to be able to kind of interpret some of some of what we're seeing as well as just have really amazing images to hopefully um, inspire more cameras, of the public yeah. as far as really just cool how yeah. amazing and diverse these ecosystems that we're finding throughout this whole Atlantic margin are. We've been on coral mounds, canyons, and seep habitats all within these two weeks. Um, and like a lot of people have stated throughout this cruise, a lot of this mm -hmm. work was is very new. Um, there wasn't a something lot of research until in, in within the 2000s to um, even them. start to really map this area of the United States. Yeah. So we're just cruising along watch lead, but so, uh, if there's any, um, just, anything if specific you'd like to look at, just let us know. Margin seats with the RV South Corps, which is a, another ship that has an ROV. Um, and there I was just we uh, use, letting you know that we're just cruising uh, along, um, from Kiel, Germany, but if you see anything Gamar, specifically you'd uh, like to look at, just let me know. And we could put it over a seat, and it used cameras, very high-speed cameras, and it could image the bubbles going up past these cameras to determine the size, and from that we can get some idea about how much methane is contained for various water depths within these bubbles, could also obviously get a rate at which the bubbles are coming out, how many at a given, over a given time period. So those are ways to estimate flux, but again, that would give you, say, one bubble stream. And you can imagine in a place like this, you could spend all day going around and making bubble box measurements at each of these different streams to try to get a rough estimate of what's coming out of the seafloor. Yeah, I'd seen some footage from Amanda 